Hey everybody, this is Stuart Fuchs. Hope that you're having a beautiful day wherever you are. And uh, what I've got here is a chord solo lesson for you. This is a nice chord solo for people just starting out. It's a very easy chord solo for beginners. And it's a preview. There's a free PDF for this. It's available on my website. There's a link in the description below. It's a preview of my upcoming chord solo book. It's gonna be an ebook. The book will have all kinds of cool solos, things that are appropriate for people just starting out, for people at an intermediate level, and also for people who are quite advanced. I'm gonna be sharing some, a uh, couple of really uh, <laughs> tricky things in there for the more advanced players out there. So I hope that you'll check that out. Please subscribe to this channel for updates on when that book is gonna be out. It should be out sometime in April of 2016 or May of 2016. So thank you very much for watching. Let's get started. Go download that PDF and I'm going to take you through this solo. It's played entirely with the thumb. All right, so the chord solo is La Raspa. It's a traditional Mexican folk song from the Veracruz region of Mexico. Sometimes it's called the Mexican Hat Dance. This is a nice song for people just starting out. It's really accessible. I'm going to be playing it entirely with my thumb. One technical note is that uh, when you see those X's, what you do is you just muffle the strings and get a dampened sound on the ukulele. So don't squeeze it all. You don't want any notes to ring. You just want a muffled sound. That's where people would be clapping. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. go faster and faster and faster. Quick little technical point to learn from this is you're going to want to learn how to strum and stop the thumb on certain strings. You know, if you take a look at the first measures, uh, as you get to the first C chord, see how my thumb only strummed three strings. So my tip for you is to really feel the thumb stop on that first finger. Try not to, you know, stop with a ton of force, but just, it just comes to rest. You'll also notice this in the second section when you're doing this. All four strings, three strings, and then one string. All right, it's just a cool thing to do to be able to control the thumb in that way. So that's the basic structure of the solo. Not too hard. A couple of technical notes. You'll notice that last phrase, I shift to the first finger. Okay, and that's notated, those numbers below the notation. Not the tablature numbers, but the small numbers in between the notes and the tablature, that's fingerings. So one is the first finger, three is your ring finger. Thanks for watching this video. Really hope that you enjoy learning La Raspa and eventually playing it for your friends and family. Have fun with it. Um, there's a link to this chord solo. It's a free PDF. It's in the video description below. So if you dug this video, would love it if you give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to this YouTube channel, Ukulele Zen. I'll be putting out more announcements about the release of this chord solo book. Most likely it'll be out in May of 2016. I'll be sending out some more sample videos like this and updates from the road, workshops, recordings, all kinds of good stuff. So really appreciate you taking the time. Have a beautiful day and I really hope that the ukulele and music has made your day wonderful today.